hey guys welcome back to the channel so in this video i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to install open 4 or open iv however you want to call it and this is the program that you absolutely need if you are into modding gta 5 and stuff like that so i'm into modding gta 5 so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys uh show you guys some of this information right here so i'm gonna leave the link in the description on how you can uh, get to this page right here and then uh, i think when you go ahead uh, i mean you can just go ahead and type open iv the first link that you do see on google right there just go ahead and click on that and of course when you get to this page you're gonna uh, get me but with this green button right here says download that i'm pretty sure i'm on, I'm on the uh new version at this very moment in time as you can see on my tax bar i do have this logo right here that's uh that's the open iv uh thing right here but we're just gonna go ahead and download this again uh just to show you guys how you can go about downloading this and of course if you do have antivirus uh installed on your computer you're probably gonna pretty much maybe get this uh sign right here i'm just gonna go ahead and encourage you to keep it and then it's gonna go ahead and download the program let's go ahead and download that i think it's pretty much done let's go ahead and open it up here real quick uh as you can see it's gonna go ahead and get me but with this window right here you're gonna go ahead and uh, select russian of course if you uh speak russian and uh, i'm still learning my english so i'm gonna go ahead and uh click on the english button right there at least it's something that i can uh try to understand a little bit we're gonna go ahead and click continue and of course you're gonna get me with the agreement over here and of course uh if you're into signing things you're gonna need to go ahead and sign this agreement right here and click accept and then of course you're gonna go ahead and click continue and then of course it's gonna go ahead and show you the pathway in which uh you can install this i think if you click uh, let me see yeah if you click um all right so if you click uh download the, the open iv for installation on a separate computer on a separate computer or pathway or whatever if you want to change the pathway if you have like a separate hard drive where you want to install this program right here you can go ahead and browse uh where you want to install it but for me i'm gonna go ahead and install it in this pathway right here i'm pretty sure that's where the old version is that i currently have at this moment in time so let's go ahead and click continue and then of course you're gonna go ahead and get this um uh pop-up box right here and then we're gonna go ahead and click yes it's gonna go ahead and continue to download um i'm maybe just updating my stuff at this moment in time but it is what it is let's see how this one is gonna turn out and you can see installation of open iv has been complete has been completed successfully so let's go ahead and close that all right uh am i gonna go up, get it go ahead and get anything here let me see all right so i did not get anything to pop out of my screen let me go ahead and try to open it over here and see if i can get something different or anything like that all right so when you do open it for the first time of course you're gonna get this menu right here and of course um uh, this is one is for pc and of course you can get all the i don't even know anything about uh modding uh ps4 ps3 or xbox 360 i don't know anything about that i'm all into some pc modding so i'm gonna go ahead and click on gta 5 windows right here so let's go ahead and click on that and of course when you get to this page yeah so this is the page you're gonna need to go ahead and open it i guess you're gonna need to open it separately or something like that so you're gonna go ahead and get this page right here so this pretty much looking like a fresh install so you're gonna go ahead and need to uh see where your gta 5 is i don't really think i know where my gta 5 is on the top of my head but i'm gonna go ahead and uh see if i can find this so let's go ahead and click browse all right so we're gonna go ahead and get this window right here and of course uh depending on whether you got your gta 5 installed like um uh, let's see maybe oh so you just sent me right straight into it right there so that's the pathway right there so mine is on uh program files times 68 uh 86 right there steam steam amps uh common and then um gta 5 right there and of course if you don't know where your uh, gta 5 is and of course if you are using steam like i am just go ahead and open steam like so all right and then you're gonna go ahead and go to your library just like so and go to your gta 5 
Uh, these are the other games that I tried to play and some of them things did not work out. So anyways, go ahead and highlight GTA 5 like so and then you right click on that, go to properties and then when you go to properties and then uh, go to local files and then um, and then browse local files. Yeah, just browse local files right there. So this will be the pathway right here all right so this will be the pathway this pc and of course i have it installed on my c drive and then you're gonna go ahead and go to uh program files times 60 uh 86 right there and go to steam go to steam amps and then you're gonna go ahead and go to common and then you're gonna find your gta 5 folder uh but let's go ahead and do it over here all right so we're gonna go ahead and uh start from scratch we're gonna go ahead and go to this pc right there all right and then i'm gonna go to my c drive and then we're gonna go to program files and then we're gonna go ahead down here we're gonna go ahead and go to steam and then we're gonna go ahead and go to steam amps and then we're gonna go ahead and go to common and then this is our gta 5 directory right here so we're gonna go ahead and say, click on this one that says gta 5 these are the other ones that i actually these are modded ones right here so i do have a first copy right there and then i do have uh the mods folder right there that this one is like for when i do play my franklin simulation type of thing this is where i do actually play that part of the game right there so this i think this one is more for my lspda5 if i'm not mistaken but let's go ahead and click on that and then click select folder and then of course if you do click select folder and if you went on the right pathway you should have this green uh stuff right here it says successfully all right gta5 version whatever version you're on at this very moment in time and then it says open iv can work with this file and then when that's done you just go ahead and click continue and then uh don't forget to back up your files and of course yeah don't forget to back up your files every time you do uh mod this game you're gonna need uh i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys when we do get to a point where we are modding gta 5 i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how you can uh back up your files and how you can prevent uh ruining your game and stuff like that so go ahead and cl click continue again and then of course it's gonna pop this window out right here it's gonna do its thing and um locate pretty much every files that you do have uh on your computer at this very moment in time especially for gta 5 that the program that we just uh opened and then it's gonna go ahead and open up um the uh modification parts of the program right here where you can actually modify the game and stuff like that all right excuse my english like i said man i am still learning my english so when you come to this page right here this is where you're gonna be doing your magic right here modifying the game and stuff like that as you can see i do have my mods folder already uh so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how you can get all of this information uh like so into your mod folder and stuff like that what we do um when i show you guys how to mod gta 5 and stuff like that for lspda 5 and maybe like for some real life mods as, as well i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys that there's gonna be a lot of tutorials coming your way on this very channel right here so if this video helped you out or should i say if you have come if you watched this video to this point right here you have successfully installed open 4 or open iv however you want to call it you have successfully installed this so in the very near future you're going to be seeing how you can use this program right here to mod gta 5 so if this video helped you out in any shape or form please do consider subscribing to the channel drop a like on the video and please do comment down below as well as of right now though i'm gonna go ahead and see if i can uh, make another tutorial or something like that so thank you so much for watching thank you so much for subscribing and i'll catch you